Hello and welcome, viewers of the Crafting News. Tonight we have a <coughs> special guest recently released from the Minecrafting Rabbit's Mental Hospital. It's true. I was a proud member of the elite psychopathic hyperkinetic gravity things that belong to that establishment. Oh, how I miss the taste of fur. Well, we aren't here tonight to discuss cannibalism with you, Max. We're here to see what you think about the first ten amendments of our Constitution. Ooh, I remember that from school. You don't say. I can name all of them if only I had my notes. So tell me, what do you think about the First Amendment? What's that? Our freedoms to express ourselves, like speech, press, petition, religion, and assembly. Oh yes! I love those things, except the press and economy. Okay, so what about Amendment 2, the right to bear arms? That right does not apply to me. I was forbidden from owning a gun when I tried murdering Connor with a luger that I stole from my friend Bosco. That was a bad day. Do you think that right should be taken away or limited? No way! I love that luger! You were dating behind Bosco's back. Alright, on to the Third Amendment. Do you know what that is? Something with the army and me and bed or something like that? Amendment 3 is about the quartering of soldiers in your home. I really like that one because that means I can go play poker and I, at a place I like to call the inventory and spend billions of my uncut diamonds and then go home guilt free because there are no soldiers that are like you, Sam, at home. Hey, did I say I'm mental? I am not a soldier. But, anyways, let's move on to the Fourth Amendment. Ooh, that's search and seizure, isn't it? Yep. So what's your opinion? Well, I like it because I don't want people to look in our office and find Jesse James' hands and other fluids for that matter. Of course, not Hugh Bliss. No, no, we, no, we didn't have anything to do with that. Well, time for a word from our sponsors. Police officers, are you tired of not knowing the Bill of Rights? Well, now is your chance. We are selling copies of the Bill of Rights for just nineteen ninety nine. Buy your copy now. Now back to our special guest. Okay then. Well, on to the Fifth Amendment. Do we have to do with court or something? Yes. It says you get a grand jury, can't be put in court twice for the same crime, and the government can't take away your property without compensating for it. I know it. It saved me when I was on trial for scaring young children on Halloween. They found me not guilty, and then they tried to bring me back again. It was fun hitting them on the head of the Constitution. Maybe that will teach them that this is an evidence to be. Uh, how do you have the Constitution? Sam, they're off the cameras right now. Well, anyway, on to the Sixth Amendment. Ooh! Either that one is really good. It lets me have a speedy trial, confront my witness, and have the trial in a state I can commit the crime in. So any stories about that one? Now I can tell uh, the police might be watching this. Well then, on to the Seventh Amendment. Yeah! That's the right to a trial by a jury in civil cases of over $20. That was helpful when I was being sued for. Enough with your trial stories already. I'm hurt, Sam. I'm hurt. Anyway, on to the Eighth Amendment. Doesn't that protect us from cruel punishment? Excessive bails and fines along with cruel and unusual punishment. Na 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 uh, what? Oops, sorry, I got distracted. Anyway, I think it's great because there was this one time when. Oops. Now for another word from our sponsors. Get this: we are offering copies of the Constitution for only five ninety nine. 
That's right, an exact replica of the Constitution for only five ninety nine. Now we are back. Well, anyway, on to the Ninth Amendment. Hello? Stop playing that game and focus. You're on live TV. All right, so what's the Ninth Amendment? It says we have rights to things that aren't stated in the Constitution. No, the last amendment is the tenth amendment. So you can guess what that is. Uh no. It is the state's right to make laws on things that aren't regulated by the government. Well that's never stop Bosco's and convenience store. I mean is a state offense just in the name. Well, that's all the time we have today, so good night, everybody.